Hi, thanks for tuning in to Trapper Don CT Outdoor Shop, edition of In the Kitchen with Trapper Don. We're going to do some deer back straps filled or stuffed, if you will, with jalapenos, <coughs> excuse me, some mushrooms, blue cheese, and bacon bits. What you want to do is slice your back strap three quarters of the way through. Bear with me, it's first time doing, you know, I'm new at cooking videos. Um, but these back straps have been soaking for about three hours in sugar free maple syrup. And Worcestershire sauce. I didn't have any brown sugar, but I did pick some up for the next video. So they've been marinating eh, three, three and a half hours. You can see they're brown, so it 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 took on the flavor. And you open that right up. Don't mind me if I'm taking some pictures here while I go along or get up to wash my hands. So you're gonna open up that back strap. My lips are burning because I touched my lips after the jalapenos. Well, like I said, please excuse me for getting up. My kitchen's a little small here. So, not really made for this, but someday hopefully I'll have uh, a good, 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 um, good kitchen or better. Like I said, don't mind me if I'm taking a few pictures here. This is all new to me. Just playing around. Okay, but what I did was I have the mushrooms and the chopped jalapenos and I sauteed them in olive oil with a little onion powder in a cast iron skillet. I diced them up. Some blue cheese. I was going to use cream cheese, but I think I'm going to do the blue cheese. And... The recipe I read in the book and I saw online called for wrapping the back strap in bacon. Sometimes I like to do things a little different. And at the price of real bacon, I don't know. Maybe next time. But I, I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try bacon bits. Okay. So, again, this is all new to me. I'm learning just like you do. And I think what we're going to do is we'll take some of the mushrooms. Whoops. Maybe I should have pounded these out. One recipe I saw online was you pound them out. But, ah, no need. I'm hoping this works out okay. Okay. I guess we'll just do them both for you. And try to... <laughs> Please bear with me. I'm not a professional chef, but... And I don't want to be. Too many hours. I'm just having fun videotaping and... Showing some of the recipes I'm trying. And again, I'm going to be taking pictures along the way, so please excuse me. You know, okay? And the pictures more so are... Just for Facebook or wherever, my library, Instagram. Okay. You guys might be able to hear the TV in the background. I got the... Well, I guess it's on every channel. Presidential race. I guess we're going to go with... Throw... Blue cheese in there. I happen to like blue cheese. I actually love blue cheese, especially on a salad. Um, like I said, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? I didn't even think about this. I didn't even think about this. So again, please excuse me if I get up and do stuff, but it just hit me.
trying not to make a mess. Like I said, I'm not a professional. Watch, it's going to stick to the knife. Just trying to flatten it here. Um, I can't turn on the TV. Hopefully, it's not interrupting. Um, but what we're going to do is, since we have two back straps, and I did buy cream cheese, uh, I guess what we'll do here is, hmm, we will do one with cream cheese and one with blue cheese. My daughter said do the blue cheese, Dad. So I was going to do both, but not the great thinker I am. It didn't hit me till I'm filming. How are we going to do this? Yes, my hands are clean and washed from COVID. I guess we'll just go like this because it's going to melt. Ooh, it might be a little too much, but it's all right. Hey, not a bad idea, huh, Trapper Don? Like I said, you can leave your comments. You can you can make fun of me. Do whatever. It's all good. Okay, I'm taking pictures here. I guess we'll take some bacon bits. Next time I'll use some real bacon, I'll wrap it. It's it's get it. It's already seven thirty here in Connecticut so and I'm starving and I'm gonna shut it down I'll remove the camera and stuff they want to get organized over by the stove and what we're gonna do is I hope these fit together um, we're gonna just fry these in olive oil in a cast iron skillet hopefully I'll be able to fold these right up because I forgot to get toothpicks Looks pretty good, though. Should be pretty yummy. And, uh, I didn't like the bacon that they had at the store anyway. Plus, the price on it was a little high for the quality. But, anyway. Let's try this. Oh, let's see if we can... Like I said, ah, it's going to be a little tough. Maybe I overstuffed them. Nope, so far so good. Be a little messy, but that's all right. Let's tuck it in. Like I said, first time doing this. I'm not a pro. Mmm. Gonna be good, though. People on YouTube make it look so easy. I guess we'll just drop that in the pan, that little extra. But, oof, looks pretty good, huh? Stuff it in there. All right. Nope, there we go. They're stuffed, they're rolled. Make sure it's all in there. I'm going to turn the camera off and get the cast iron skillet with some olive oil going in it. And then I'll refill. Okay, part one. Stuffed back straps. One with cream cheese, bacon, jalapenos, and mushrooms. The other one with blue cheese, jalapeno, and mushroom and bacon bits. Part one. I'll do a quick video cooking them and then cutting them open. Thanks for tuning in. Trapper Don CT Outdoor Show, November 3rd, 2020. In the kitchen with Trapper Don.